Hello, my name is Frank and welcome to Learning in Technology. Have you ever been part of a project or team that involves you traveling to different locations? Maybe you're part of a real estate company, or maybe you're part of a hiking club, or maybe you're part of a sports team, and you need directions to different places. Well, instead of switching between applications to find directions, you can embed those directions directly into your teams, and they're right there for you when you need them. In this video, I'll show you how to embed geographic and location information directly into Teams. Here I am in my team for the home staging experts. And so we're a company that does home staging, and that means that we're traveling to and from different locations around the city. So I'm going to hit the ellipse and I want to add in an app called Places. And if I go into Places, when I go in, you'll notice that mine says Open. If you have not yet added the application, it'll say Add, and then you can open up the application. When you first open up the application, you'll need to put in your current location, but you'll notice that because I've installed it, I can enter a location that I want to go to. So let's say, for example, I just got a contract to stage the Calgary Tower. So for those of you not in Calgary, the Calgary Tower is an old tower here in Calgary. I did not get a contract to stage it. So if we go here, it's going to put the address for that Calgary Tower there. And then I can go in and I can say, okay, let's copy that and let's put that into a conversation. So I can paste it right in and you can see that I've got the address in there. But even better than that, if I go in and start a new conversation and go at places, I can go into places and here I can search for the same location, Calgary Tower. And when I search for the Calgary Tower here, so we'll just do a quick search, it'll actually put the map for the Calgary Tower right there into my team's environment. And then when I'm on a mobile device, I can simply hit directions and it'll take my current location of my mobile device and give me routing directions to the location that I need to be at. Let's take a look at that. Here I am on my mobile device, so I'm going to go into Teams and underneath Teams I'm going to go in and you can see that that location there is now available to me. So I go into my teams and I can say, oh, I need to go out and I need to stage a house. Here's my current house. I could have any sort of message in there. And then I'm going to hit directions. It's going to automatically give me directions to get to that location from my current location. And that's going to be useful for team members and any movers or delivery services that I'm using. What's excellent about this is that I can have one team member who's in charge of taking all of the information of where people need to go and all of my mobile drivers and people that are out and about in the city can easily see where they're supposed to go next, get directions to where they're supposed to go and of course we could go in here saying things like, I got this one, you know, whatever the case may be, so we can have a conversation around any of the various places that we need to go. One of the ways that I like to do this is under new conversation, you can go in and create an announcement and you could say, you know, house number 234 and you know, we could put information about the house in here, uh, Wednesday, delivery, and then we could put in whatever our announcement is, including an at places where we could go in and we could put in the location here. And again, I'll just use something like uh, Mountain Equipment Co-op here in Calgary. So it'll find the closest Mountain Equipment Co-op. And there you go. So we have the house. We're gonna now go doing staging at Mountain Equipment Co-op. Thank you for watching. I hope that was useful. If it was, hit the like button, subscribe for more tips and longer videos, and share with any colleagues that might benefit from this information. Thank you for watching. Here's some other videos you can check out on my channel.